What's up? Hey guys, it's Ivan. In this video, I want to show you how to promote on Facebook ads using ClickMagic campaigns, okay? So if you watched my previous two videos on Microsoft ads and Google ads tracking with ClickMagic campaigns, you should get the idea. It's pretty simple. <clears throat> Uh, but make sure that you do check out the very first video on campaigns I made because you do have to set the campaigns up, okay? So make sure to check that out first. If you have already set the campaigns up and you're ready to promote, we're gonna go back to our URL builder and we can create a new kind of uh, link here for Facebook, but we already did in that first video. So we have here a link specific to Facebook with CPC and with custom keto diet as the name, okay? So we're just gonna be using this link question is where do you put it so we're gonna copy it let's go back into Facebook and what we're gonna do is in this website URL field is where we simply paste our click magic campaign link so we're gonna go in and paste it here and that is it okay it's as simple as that now Facebook does give you an, uh, a few other tokens you can use so for example if you go to this page here I will link it they give you the ability to add all these tokens so the ad name, the ad set name, the campaign name, for example. So you can use these tokens in your link and the values will show up in ClickMagic. So if you use this campaign name token, for instance, for example, for the term, then instead of it saying campaign name, it's gonna give you the actual name of the campaign, okay? Likewise for anything else, for placement, for instance, if you use that, it, for example, for the term, then you will see the exact placement where, um, your ClickMagic ad was shown, where exactly on Facebook, okay? So if we wanna add additional things here, we could go back to our URL builder and we can just create it again, or we could go to URL manager, take this link and just add on top of it, okay? Let's keep it simple, let's just quickly redo this. So we'll say Facebook here, say CPC. Uh, this one, the name was Custom Keto Diet. And so here's where we can use this optional parameter. So for example, if we want to say the ad set name, we can go ahead and copy this here we can copy that, paste it back here. Uh, it might not allow us, hold up. That's it, name, okay. I don't know why it didn't let us paste it, but we just do that. Um, and let's say we want the ad name, right, for the exact ad. So again, we're gonna copy it, I'm gonna control C, paste it here, nope, doesn't let us, okay. So we gotta do it again. Uh, what do we have to do, it's just ad name, ad dot name, okay. So there you go, so this is our new link. We can now save and copy, and it's gonna be available in the URL manager. And that's the link, so we're gonna copy this, go back here, delete this, and just paste it here. Um, paste it here, there you go, okay? And that's it, that's how you do it. Now this ad set name will be pre-populated instead with the actual name of the ad set, which in this case is Piano Digital Piano Engaged Choppers the ad name will be replaced by this name, Untitled Ad, okay? So make sure you go in there and make change the name of the ad to reflect what this is. So like, um, what's the name of this ad? You know, like how to learn piano, so question. Um, how to play piano, for example. And then, yeah, woman playing piano, something like that, okay? So we know now what this ad is, right? This ad is starts off with that question and then it has a picture of a woman playing piano. So we know that this is the ad that made that click or that sale once we see it here, okay? And then because we have this, uh, where is it? <laughs> Our website right here. So we have the ad set name and the term and the ad name. So we're gonna see, once we start running traffic, we'll see the actual ad set name. So it's not gonna be in squiggly brackets. It's gonna have the actual name show up under the term and it's gonna have the ad name show up under the content. And that is it, ladies and gentlemen, that's how you uh, create your and run your Facebook ads using ClickMagic campaigns. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video.